What's up guys, welcome back to The Bearded Journey. I am your host, Scott Barnes, and in today's video, I wanna go over the first stage of beard growth. That's right, the first stage. Now before we get started, I want to enlighten you on a product that I do enjoy and definitely mellows me out. I know we're living in some crazy times, but now more than ever, we miss that barber shop. And this is a great way to bring it into your house with Artius Man's Barbershop Candle. So go ahead and light up the day and have that great barbershop smell with Artius Man's Thick Wick Barbershop Candle. Enjoy. So now that we are in the zen of beard growth, first I wanna commend you on the bearded journey. I know it's very hard to switch up the game plan of going from clean and shaven to rough and scruffy. That is the first part of the beard stage of beard growth is the awkward stage, the, um, the unevenness in our beards and our mustache, and this is a tough month to go through. Now obviously the first thing that's going to be different is the facial hair that's growing out in all different directions, and this is the number one reason why that first month is the toughest month because we wanna shave it off, and this is where we need to push through and just trust that the beard's gonna grow in nice, full, and thick. And even if it doesn't grow nice, full, and thick, there are beard products to help us out along the way. Beard oils, beard brothers, anything along the way that can help us out thicken that beard up to that glorious beard that we all want. Now, another tough part about going into that first stage of beard growth is going to be our predecessors and our commenters when it comes to uh, our social game. So there's gonna be a lot of people that are gonna be telling you one thing, there's gonna be a lot of people telling you another, but just trust in yourself that you are going to have a nice, good-looking beard, and don't worry about the naysayers because it's going to happen, but it's what you want in the end of the day. Now, one of the first things that you can do to get past this first stage of beard growth uh, and it's gonna kill a little bit of my sales but it's don't buy too much product don't get too invested early all right I know it's uh, kind of tempting to just start buying beard butters oils balms and combs but my advice is just start with a nice beard oil that you like a favorite company of yours might be Artius man might be live bearded Fable Beard Co. I've got tons of them go down the link uh, to find something that you might like but buy yourself probably just a nice you know in the middle uh, of the line beard oil, uh, one of maybe your you know scent that you might like, and also buy yourself maybe a comb or a brush. And those two right there are gonna be a great asset when it comes into the later games in the beard growth, but right now that'll be just something great to start out with. Uh, spend about $20 uh, or so, and uh, we'll uh, go ahead and soften up our skin because I know that's probably the first thing that's gonna be happening in that beard growth is going to be the beard itch. But once you can get past that, use that uh, oil, use that brush just to push everything away, get it nice and groomed. So that way when we're getting that second and third month, we actually have a style and also a way for your beard actually to grow. And that's one of the first things that we need to go through too is uh, we need to give your beard a little bit of direction uh, where it needs to grow. Beard direction is key and this is where you're gonna start finding the uh, beard style that you're gonna to wanna to go for. So a lot of people might wanna go down, straight down, and make a round or square look. Some people like to brush it back, get that painter's goatee. There's lots of variations in the beard growth and in the journey that you can choose from what you want. And the last thing I wanna to touch upon is beard confidence. Like I said, this is gonna be a very awkward time in your life, especially if you haven't grown out your beard before. And if you already have, this is something that you can just push through. But that first month and a half is very difficult because uh, there's some changes going on in your facial game and in your look that you're not used to. But definitely just push past it. Uh, and if you can look at other uh, beard channels, you'll see that in time and time again, you'll always come out great in the end. Just persevere through those times. So this is a great time to, if you'd like to, just kind of have a game plan of what you want to do and what style or beard length you want to choose. So if you want to have just, you know, maybe a uh, three or four month beard growth, or if you want to have that long epic beard and mustache, uh, this is the time to choose what you want. And then uh, after once you achieve those goals, which obviously we all need as goals, because once we reach those goals, then we can go on to the next stage. Um, but uh, that's what we want in the first stages of beard growth is to have a mindset of what we want. And then once we achieve that, we'll go on to the next level. So uh, this is a great time to think about what you want in the end. 
use those products uh, just a little easy in the first time, but the biggest hurdle is that first uh, beard stage is the awkwardness and uh, that scruffiness, the itchy. Just let's go ahead and push past that, and once we can push past that, uh, we'll go ahead and start getting into that beard glory, like I said, that we all want. And with that, that's pretty much it. I know it's a simple topic to go over, but at the same time, it's a difficult mind game to push through. Uh, so like I said, just go ahead and watch some of my previous beard videos. I know I'm in that short game, which I'm growing out right now. And uh, in the next video, I'll actually start diving into different products uh, within that beard growth of what we need and what we need to use within that time of beard growth. So that being said, you guys, grow strong, uh, grow long, and uh, make sure that you're um, you know, keeping diligence of what you want to look like in the end of the beard game, because this is the Bearded Journey, and I am your host, Scott Barnes, just like always, you guys. So uh, just be confident, uh, stay strong, and you can do it, all right? So go with you guys, like and subscribe, check me out on all that social media. Love you guys like always, and I'll see you on the flip side. See ya!